Welcome back. It's your boy Roddy Too Good. Welcome to another episode of the Pilot Show. Oh, so let's get it, bro. We got some stuff, man. We got some stuff, bro. Like now that I fully, I ain't gonna lie, man. The last video, people was in my comments. They were saying things. Oh man, this now. Ah, but to be fair, we we ain't hit a full song. We just heard that little part. Of the Drake song, but I ain't even gonna lie, you know, I ain't no capper, I ain't no hater. Drake did, he did his thing on that song, he did his thing, he was rapping, like, the first, yeah, like, the, them cutting out the first part really messed it up for me, but, um, yeah, I ain't gonna lie, he he did his thing on that song, and now, now that I know how the song com came about, it's a little understandable. Now, now, Sexy Red, they put out a video, Sexy Red, she was with, um, Gillian Wallow. And she was explaining, like, yo, how the song came about. So, the song was originally supposed to be her and Chief Keef. And, like, I guess, like, Chief Keef had came to him and was like, yo, why everybody asking me, am I your baby daddy? And she was like, yo, what you be telling them? And she, he was like, I be telling them, don't worry about it. He be like, yeah, that's right. So, like, and then he was, like, trying to talk to her about doing, like, a little R&B song. And that's what, like... That's the joke. That's the little inside the joke that they have. Like, oh, we go together. We go together. But, and then I guess something happened. He probably couldn't. He probably couldn't do the song or whatever. But, um, I guess Drake came in and saved the day for it and whatever. But I ain't gonna lie. Drake on the verse, he, he did his thing on there, yo. He did his thing. I ain't no hater, bro. Like, I'm gonna give props with props is due. Drake did his thing, bro. But, I mean, I still, I still do the, the Joe Button thing. I still think he getting money off of it. Like, I still... Uh, like he's something he gotta be her manager or something like he's really like all the but i say that to say this um her album she dropped the album uh damn i ain't even i ain't even peep the name of the album i just listened to the songs but anyway she dropped, <laughs> she dropped the album and, um i ain't gonna lie man she got some solid she got it's solid yo it's solid well obviously you know get sexy is on there and then she had like and then, like, yo, she really, like, taking this whole, like, Chief Keef persona. Like, Chief Keef is very, very influential to, like, a certain generation of, like, rappers. So, like, like the first, the intro comes on, and it's, like, how, it's, like, if you heard Love Sosa, and you heard that, like, it's just like that. Like, but it's, like, some other guy with, like, a, a way better, like, vocabulary or something. Like, he talking mad proper on it. So, it's, like, that, and then she get into, like, a... Like uh she's back. I like that song. I like uh Boss Me Up. I like the um the uh You My Everything. I like that. I like that a little bit. Like it, it she's switching up like I like that a little bit. Her and Drake. I like that. And then uh Sport. I like Sport. I like Sport. Sport probably one of my favorite songs on that joint. But um what else? Um the thing with Mike Will made it uh, outside, yo. That's a little. It's a little different. It's a little like a. Damn, how can I say it? Like a little club dancey type music. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. Like it's it's different for sexy red, but I ain't gonna lie. I, I'm I'm feeling that a little bit. Like in the, it probably in the right environment. That should probably go off. Um, it's called outside, and it's her and uh, uh, Mike Will made it. I'm um. He's probably producing this shit, but that shit is fire, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. That right there is a that's a that's my little that's my little uh, sleeper right there. That's a little sleeper right there for y'all. But um, overall, when the thing here's the thing with Sexy Red, bro. Sexy Red, like I think her making that song "Female Gucci Man" was a perfect, perfect, perfect song for her because I believe like she really is the female Gucci Man. Like yo, I feel like they have like kind of the same cadence, kind of the same lyrical pattern, like, yo, I just, it's just, and it just works for her, like, and she stays in, you see her, like, trying, trying new things, like, like, with the white, like, with the Mike Will made it joint, but, um, not gonna lie, um, this is solid for her, I don't know, I don't really be paying attention to sales and all that stuff, me, personally, if the music is good, like, that's really, that matters to me, but, um, I don't know. I don't even have a prediction for this sales or anything like that. I just I just think it's a solid joint. And not only that, with all the songs I named, Get It Sexy is on there. So that's 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 a solid like one, two, three, four, five, six, six. 
that's a solid six songs that I could see go back and listen to that. So I ain't gonna lie, the album is like, I think it's like twelve or like twelve or fourteen songs on there. So look at that, half of the like half of the album. So I ain't gonna lie, like then this this is just off the first listen, but um. Yeah, this is off the first listen, so I ain't even let other things marinate. But I can tell you right now, those are songs I'll probably go back to, especially that sport. That shit go crazy. I saw the um the TTG. That might be a little bit alright if I listen to it a couple more times. But um, yeah, man, that's it. I ain't gonna lie, man. I could gotta. I gotta start see now. I got I gotta start doing little album reviews, album rankings. Like yo, see that. This is going to be like my little exercise in my album rankings. So, you know I got the whole flight theme, like the whole plane theme. So, now, for the bad albums, like we're going to go from bottom to top. All right? So, the, the lowest thing you could get, that's baggage claim. You know, pack that shit up and get that out of here, bro. Baggage claim, and then you get into like the boarding, like you're boarding. Like you you about to get on the plane. So, that's, that's two and then you got uh economy that's a that's a that's right there that's like economy is like a middle so that's like all right like yo you 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 in there you in there like you it's like it's solid like it's solid it's good so economy is solid and good all right so first class is like first class is fire and just like first class is it like that's gonna be fire and then Pilot, like yo, pilot, yo. If you if you get a whole pilot album, bruh, psst, that's like pilot album is like some get rich or die trying like that. Like yo, that's a pilot album. Like yo, all right, son, you you wilding out right now. Like that's how that's how I'm gonna do my little uh my rankings for uh these albums, yo. Cause I wanna I wanna uh touch on some more of these albums like reviews and all that stuff. So right now, right now off the first listen. Now this is off the first listen. So I got Sexy Red album as probably just economy, bro. Like that's it. Like that's it. Off the first album, off the first listen, it's economy for me. It has potential. It has potential to do some other things. I ain't gonna lie, but right now I got economy. Like so, yeah. So it's a kind for though the album ranking is economy for me. So I'm a um. Yeah, man, and I ain't gonna be like, I ain't gonna lie, I, I, ain't, I can't be mad at Drake for what he did, I understand, this wasn't a set thing, so this wasn't, so he really was like, kind of a replacement, so, even with that, like, he did his thing on the thing, hearing the whole song, finally, like, you know what I'm saying, but, um, yeah, man, like, comment, subscribe, yo, go in the comment, and go in the comment section, god damn, you hear that? was fighting like yo <laughs> the words was fighting to come out yo go in the comment section and tell me what y'all think about the album tell me what y'all think about the drake verse because i see a lot of mixed reviews like people were saying he was off beat i ain't gonna lie they was capping yo they was capping yo i ain't gonna hold you they was capping like um but yeah man go in the comment tell me what y'all think about it peace